The last 12 months have seen biotech stocks enter into a significant bear market, owing to a range of external factors. The macroeconomic concerns have understandably impacted decision-making, and the possibility of a recession has been especially troublesome for perceptions surrounding biotech companies, especially those not yet generating revenues. Constant interest rate hikes by the Fed, have not only made financing by debt far more burdensome for companies, but have also resulted in much smaller valuations for micro-cap and small-cap players. Merger and acquisition activity in the industry had seen a drastic plummet for these reasons. Many analysts point out however, that the biotech industry is on the verge of a turning point, with the primary catalyst being the US midterm elections. Fears of drug price regulation are fast subsiding, after Republicans continue to push closer to achieve a majority in the lower House of Congress. Economists also have been projecting favorable outcomes in terms of inflation control, and interest rate normalization, entering into 2023. This presents a ripe opportunity for long-term investors to seek entry points into the biotech industry. Each of the stocks presented in this video are ideal for this purpose, and ensure long-term value creation. The first biotech stock we take a look at is Aptos Biosciences Incorporated, trading under the ticker, APTO. The company is essentially one that aims to address the unmet needs in the medical realm, through its expertise in oncology. The stock had taken a beating in the prior year, falling by about 70% during this time, despite holding not one but two promising candidates which could turn into billion dollar drugs. The first of these is Tuspatinib, which is a single agent drug aimed at treating mutation dominant AML subtypes, such as the hardest to treat forms of leukemia. Although it is in a very early stage, the management has built up a solid clinical data set, which stands as highly compelling, and creates the room for phase 2 studies to take place later in 2023. Its second drug, Lexeptinib faced unexpected issues in the past, but with new drug formulations, the management has been highly optimistic about its prospects. Not only has the candidate cleared safety testing, but has also reported solid composite complete remission statistics. Lexeptinib taps into a small market, with annual demand coming from merely 7,000 patients, but due to current pricing, this represents projected revenue figures of exceeding $1 billion. The company has an extremely strong liquidity profile, with over $55 million in cash, which the management states gives it enough runway through to 2024. As its candidates advance into mature phases of development, with positive results, raising additional finance also becomes easier. Despite the risk and uncertainty, the potential of Aptos is far higher than its present market capitalization of $65 million, hinting at a heavy undervaluation. The second stock we turn to look to is Crystal Biotech Incorporated, a $2 billion American company which trades under the ticker, KRYS. The company is only one of three in existence, working towards a treatment for the genetic condition affecting young children, called dystrophic epidermolysis bullosa, or DEB. The condition results in open wounds and skin blisters, which are extremely painful to experience. Along with Crystal Biotech, Abiona Therapeutics, and Amrit Farmers have also been developing their own treatments to this condition, however, Crystal's candidate takes the lead by the most significant metrics. All three players have completed their Phase 3 trials in a successful manner, allowing easy comparison of data. Unlike its competitors, the Crystal Biotech candidate is the only one that ensures more complete and durable healing, and reduction in pain severity, given its more targeted, rather than general approach. In terms of efficacy therefore, KRYS stands as a clear winner. Even more impressive for the company is the fact that its treatment is a redosable and topical form of gene treatment, making it far safer, and simple to administer, compared to those of its peers, which are one-time and more intrusive procedures. KRYS, given its milestone achievements and standards, also is highly likely to see approval in the US market, and subsequently in the EU, instantly giving it entry into a billion-dollar market. 
Its liquidity position of $429 million gives it ample runway to push on its drug development to commercialization. The stock is on the verge of a boom, and buying it now would be a phenomenal win for investors. Before we move on to the next stock, we'd like you to know that we offer a morning newsletter to our email subscribers. Prior to the market opening, we send our subscribers an informative email about which stocks are moving or about to move. You will get an overview of key earnings reports, recent insider transactions, analyst upgrades, and downgrades. To take advantage of this offer, you can find the link in the description box. If you're still with us, it means you've liked our video. Do click on the like button to show your support. For number 3 on our list, we turn to one of the largest players of the biotech space, AstraZeneca PLC, which holds the ticker, AZN. With a market capitalization of almost $200 billion, AZN is a safe pharmaceutical play, with a business model that is already established, and therefore, highly effective. In its most recent earnings release, AZN saw its quarterly revenue jump year over year from $9.9 .9 billion to $11 billion, whereas its gross profit jumped by an impressive 46%. The company in 2022, saw its medicinal products attain regulatory approval from major markets such as the US, Europe, Japan, and China, which has been a catalyst for such strong growth. Each of AstraZeneca's segments remains extremely strong, yet the core growth driver is clearly its oncology segment. Its cancer treatment product, Linpaza, alone brought in nearly $700 million in sales, up 15% from the prior year. Although other players such as Pfizer also have similar products launched, Linpaza was one of the first to enter the market. This gave it a two-year head start, during which it captured immense market share, and became a standard of care throughout hospitals across the globe. This is a major reason as to why competitor pharma giants, remain unable to boast such solid growth figures for their cancer products, as AZN is able to. The company remains equally as formidable a force in other segments too, and continues to ease the pressure off global healthcare systems through its innovative products. With AZN stock, investors would not be taking a risk, and would already be buying into a winner, that is on its upward climb. Next up, we take a look at the biotech company operating in the cellular metabolism realm, Agios Pharmaceutical Incorporated, trading under the ticker, AGIO. The company is not only operating in the multi-billion dollar space, but is extremely cash laden with holdings of over one billion dollars, and zero debt. Its upside potential can be gauged from the fact that its present price stands below $29, whereas JP Morgan has set its target for AGIO at almost $50. This year, Agios had one of its candidates, Pirok and attain FDA approval, and has since then been commercialized, and launched in the market. Pirokand is a treatment for hemolytic anemia, and caters to a lucrative market in the United States. Prior to its launch, Treatments were highly costly, complex, and were conducted through blood transfusion and bone marrow transplants. This has pulled in net sales of almost $10 million this year. Moreover, the company has received the relevant green light for Pirokin's launch in the EU, from the European Medicines Agency, which would further expand its addressable market. Building on its strengths in this domain, which saw the successful launch of Pirokind, Agios has five more pivotal trials in progress, and several early-stage candidates, giving it a highly robust development pipeline. The management is confident, that through modifications, Pirokind could stand as a highly effective treatment against thalassemia and sickle cell disease. Investing in AGIO now would be a highly strategic move, that is likely to pay off extremely handsomely in the longer term future. The final stock on our list, and far from being the least is Halozyme Therapeutics Incorporated, which trades under the ticker, HALO. The most remarkable aspect of Halozyme, is its transformation from a failed research and development company, to a highly successful biotech royalty player. 
it has managed to pull this shift, and set itself on the massive growth trajectory, despite holding no active product pipeline. Despite failing to launch its enhanced platform, HALO has successfully initiated a licensing program, including the platform, and its auto-injector technology, which has delivered its $700 million this year alone. In addition to platform royalties, Halozine has also successfully set itself to gain big on milestone updates, with almost $200 million coming in on each achievement. This delivers it a highly sustainable, and diversified revenue stream. The management has set up a wave-based business model, focusing on specific products on each wave, in a strategic manner to maximize lifetime revenue, based on exclusive rights expiry. As a result, both HALO and its partners are shielded by a robust patent barrier, to maximize value delivery to shareholders. Furthermore, the management is highly committed to share buybacks, having spent over $1 billion towards this, in the last two years alone. HALO is an unconventional biotech stock, that has set itself up similarly to a pharmaceutical mutual fund, and thus enjoys all the benefits of risk diversification and value optimization. It is by far, one of the most shareholder-friendly players in the pharmaceutical space. That's all from us in this video, we hope the insight we aimed to deliver has proven valuable to you, and would allow you to take on an enhanced biotech growth strategy. We would love to hear your feedback about our list in the comments below. To gain a deeper insight into different stocks that are fit for various investment strategies, be sure to take a look at our website, StocksTelegraph.com.